We might have a quarterback controversy in the desert now. Welcome in. I'm Prim Saripapat alongside our NFL insider, Lewis Riddick, mm -hmm. with your ESPN headline. There's an Cardinals starting quarterback, Carson Palmer, who's been dealing with a mysterious nerve injury to his throwing arm, says he will definitely be ready to go by week five against the Broncos. But their backup, Drew Stanton, mm -hmm. he's been impressive. In the meantime, the Cardinals are 2-0 and with Stanton on their center, 3-0 and overall. What do you think of Palmer's comments, Lewis? Well, you got to take him for his word. I mean, this is a veteran now who really understands his body. You know he's been rehabbing like crazy. Nerves are a, tip, are a tricky issue, especially when you're talking about your throwing shoulder. So if he's saying he thinks he'll be ready for week five, then, you, you know, you got to believe him. And um, I, I don't necessarily know if it's a, a quarterback controversy because he really didn't do anything to lose his job. That's why I said might. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, and, and Bruce Arian seems like a very straight shooter and not a guy who would really let this kind of thing linger as far as is there a controversy. Drew Stanton did exactly what you brought him in there to do. And that's a great job by their front office and their coaching staff of identifying someone that could execute that offense that way, win games when the starter's down, and then plug the starter back in there. At least now you know going forward that you're set up pretty well at that right. position in the event that it happens again. So I don't think it necessarily has to be a, a quarterback competition, and Bruce Arians is a great leader, so I think he'll handle it the right way. But at the same time, Stanton, during those two games, he, his completion percentage – 50%, yeah. threw for over uh, 400 yards, two touchdowns, zero interceptions. Mm -hmm. so, but at the end of the day, who gives them a better chance to win? You're still going with Palmer? Yeah, I'm, I'm still going to go with Palmer at this point. And like I said, it's just good to know that you have the dynamic between the starter and the backup exactly the way you want because that's tricky. You've seen how many teams can't get that right and how that can absolutely just derail your season. So you just, you just know that you have options going on forward down the road. In the event that Carson somehow has played deteriorated, you know you can bring the number two in. But you don't really need, as Bill Polian says, you don't really need to create a quarterback controversy if you don't really have one. You know who your starter is. Right. Now you know you have a 1A, so you just keep on rolling. All right, so the Arizona Cardinals, they get a little time off. They've got a bye week this week, and then after that they will travel to Denver to face Peyton Manning and the Broncos in Week 5 on October 5th. Keep it logged on to ESPN.com. We'll keep you updated with this story. For Lewis Riddick, I'm Prim Sarifapat.